This damn cat is always in the way and shit. What's going on, guys? Lockout men, right here. About to get something started for you right quick. Y'all remember when I put out in the uh, community post, I asked for drivers to come on and talk about the companies that they that they work or work for. Well, let me rephrase that. Either driven, drive or driven for. How's that? And so far, I had a couple of people, but now I got another one. We got another driver, former, former driver, He's a former driver uh, of this particular company. Now, I, I thought the company, I, I thought this company, man, this, uh, this, this company Hogan, I thought it was a local company. It's, it's not a local company. Uh, no, yeah, yeah, yeah actually, it's, uh, it's a regional company. But ain't ain't it ain't it located out of uh out of Ohio though? Yeah, they got something in Ohio, something uh still. But I I thought it was located out of, I thought it was located out of Ohio, right? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. So it's so it's a it's it's a company that's it's it's an Ohio company. Yeah. Oh, okay, 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 okay. All right, guys. So, what's up, guys? Lockout men here, and I'm. We're 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 we're. I I don't want to call it exposing companies or anything like that. It's just to give you guys like the good, the bad, and the ugly side of 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 the companies from a driver's perspective. Now this dude right here, you know, you probably you 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 want to you want to remain anonymous, or you want to tell the people who you are. No, nah, good. All right, this is my man Kenneth. Ken, I, I, how you pronounce your last name? Manafi? Ma, ma, <laughs> Manafi? What? How you pronounce? Matheny. 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 Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. So so Ken, my my man Ken reached out to me, and he was like, "Yo." Uh, I got a company that I want to talk about right quick. We can uh, let some, you know, new jacks know about uh, about this potential company. Now, my man, to give a little bit of background about uh, about Ken, um, me and him both went to the same school, which was Tri C. At the time, it was called Tri C Trucking Academy, right? But now they they changed it to some technical shit I, I i can't even i can't even remember the name man i can't even remember the name do you still remember do you still remember the dudes that's uh that that we went to school with do you still remember them do, are, do, do they keep in contact do you keep in contact with them well well no i really don't even uh keep in contact with them you know i, I do know their name this is only when we were about seven of us yeah, yeah, it was only, the, uh, yeah, it was only yeah, it was only seven. It was me, you, yeah. the eighteen yeah, the, or the eighteen year yeah, old Earl, dude, Earl, okay, Kevin, Kevin, uh, Brian, Brian, the white uh, guy. This one guy we called Big Country. Big, that was that was that was it. Wasn't that the one that Mister Know It All, the the one that thought yeah. he knew everything. Yeah, and then when we got then when we got in the damn truck that night, he was he grinding truck, gears he, he, like he a motherfucker. Yeah. He ain't no, yeah. she ain't no shit. <laughs> yeah, then you had the uh, RTA driver, Mister Bus Man. Well, wait, no, no, the RT, no, no, the R. Oh, he was an yeah, RTA no, he, driver. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, but yeah. he was he was coming there to upgrade his license to an A. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. All right, so Kenneth, man, uh, we're, we 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 going to talk about um, we 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 going to talk about uh, Hogan Transport. There, where where they uh where they located at, man? They're located in Zanesville, Ohio. Mm-hmm. I see about about thirty minutes outside. Uh, about mm, like four hours. 
Okay. Uh, I'm from uh, Cleveland. All right. So, what what was your experience with them, man? You you um take 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 us through uh the good. What's what was the good about the company? Like, you know, take you know, tell tell us what's the good about the company. Uh, they, they, uh, the first thing is that they, they always have freight. I was with the uh, Dodge General account, so they always had freight. Mm-hmm. You know, um, yeah, they, they had. You know, as soon as you got done with with uh, the one trailer, you go back to the DC, mm-hmm. pick up another one, you go on again. So like you, you're driving. You're actually out there for for, for a whole week. You you are constantly, um, you know, uh, constantly got got a freight. So, okay, that's the one thing right there that's that's pretty good. They had uh, steady work. So you you was a you was a company driver. Was was you a company driver? Yeah. yeah. So how was how was it when when you came in to uh orientation? Uh what was the what was the recruiting what was the recruiting phase? Take take us through take us through all of that. Uh, that 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 right there was r- real fast. It's only like 3 days. Um first day um you 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 go in there for, for some videos then you go in there for your uh paperwork um then the next day you doing some more videos and then the last day which is to about 12 o'clock you're still doing the paperwork that you didn't do uh the first day then after that you get in your truck and you got your first load go ahead and go all right. Did they offer you some kind of uh, sign-on bonus or anything like that? Uh, yeah, it was a uh, it was a twenty five hundred dollar uh, sign-on bonus. Mm-hmm. Back then, so I don't know if they're doing it now, but back then it was like a twenty five dollar uh, uh, twenty five hundred dollar uh, bonus. Okay. Okay. Did you? How, how was it paid out? Um, increments. A five um five hundred without the uh, uh like a six uh, for like six months. So was it uh what what did you did you get did you get paid out the whole thing or? Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Oh, so yeah. you so it it was paid out in it was paid out in a year. How how long you was yeah. with them? Yeah, I was here for I was there with them for a year. Oh, okay, okay. So what 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 other what other good things that you can that you can that you can say about the company why why you was there? Um, there's a couple of driver managers that was cool, you know, and had no no uh, hiccups. Of course, you got some in there that you know that they thought they knew everything about it, but you know, um, I probably knew more than they did. But there's some in there. That was cool. Uh, their boss, Eric, he was, it was phenomenal. Um, the, uh, the equipment, they, they're all uh, international. Uh, um, uh, Max Forces. Oh, okay. So was that so was the was the equipment was was do they have a what 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 type of fleet they have automatic or manual? Um, actually, they had both. Oh, okay. so whatever you were comfortable with uh, driving, um, you know that's what you get. So I had a ten speed, mm-hmm. you know. So and most of the fleet was uh, well you. Know, you you had your picker. You, you had your uh, pick of the uh, uh, of the fleet. Okay, so you had your picker either uh, automatic or or manual. Yeah. Now I remember when I went out with you. <laughs> Woo, man, <laughs> we 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 had some issues, but 
but dude, you 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 came into you 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 came into your own on a on a manual, man. You like you like sweetness on it now, huh? Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Now I'm uh, skipping gears. Now I haven't really uh, double clutching none of that. Oh, okay. So I was in you know in the school. Yeah, I did. I did all that grinding gears and. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Right until you find them, or you know, saying anything. So <laughs> I know that's right, man. That's how it was, man. Back then, back then when we was in school, man, we was woo, we was greenhorns. But now we could, you yeah. know, psh, I still, I, I don't know about you, man. I, I, me personally, I still double clutch. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I, I, I don't float the gears. I, I know, yeah. I, I know, you know, the experienced guys out there, you know, they could, they could. Psh, me, I, I still mm. double clutch, man. I, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, doop, doop. You know, I, I still remember. I still remember the way that, uh, that, uh, that, that the dude showed me how to do it. Because remember, we was riding down Euclid, and I, I mm. couldn't, I, I couldn't get, I couldn't get the clutch for shit. But he pulled me over, got me right, and here we are now, man. What type of, um. Right. All right, so back to Hogan, man. Sorry, sorry about that, y'all. My my fault. We just reminisce right quick. But uh, back to Hogan, man. Um, do do they have uh do they have a pet and rider policy there? Yeah. All right. Well, yeah. what well, what was the policy like? Think, uh, policy was it was it was three hundred the one time. And that's it. Mm-hmm. One time fee. Uh, three hundred bucks. Um. Then then they got a a, uh, a a rider policy, which is they you you actually just uh, cover them on the uh, insurance is like twenty five dollars, uh, one time fee. All right, hold on, right uh, quick. Oh no, you good, you good. Um, so just a one time fee of uh three hundred dollars, and you know the right is that for a pet and rider or just for the pets? That's just for the pet for the uh, three hundred. Okay. What about uh? What about riders? Do they? The rider is uh is uh twenty five uh um one time fee. All right. What what uh what advice would you give someone that's that's interviewing at Hogan? What 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 advice would you give them? Um. Yes, yeah, I do start off at you got. Well, he has about six months experience, mm-hmm. so I'll just say just be truthful with him. Okay. You know. Okay. Because uh, they do give you uh, a rider partner, which is just some like a mentor. Mm-hmm. You know, for for maybe like two weeks. On the people, how long you been driving to? All right. So. So be truthful first off. Okay. So Hogan and, and, and Oh, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Um I say be truthful first. Mm-hmm. And um and if you those well, if, if you well it's the same thing I'm just saying. You, you can hold uh if you can drive the truck, drive that truck. Okay. Okay. So that's uh so Hogan, man, they uh do they do they pay out weekly or bi weekly? Weekly. What's what's uh what's the average miles there that 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 you can that you can get? Um, I was getting between six to eight hundred. That's at the day. Uh, so about a week, I'll be. I was doing say, about three thousand miles a week. Oh, about three thousand. All right. Yeah. What's the what's what's the what's the starting CPM there? Or do well do they pay do they pay uh, CPM or do they pay percentage? Uh, they you get uh CPM. What's what's so it depends on your um uh, experience too. Right. Uh, you start off with. Forty cents a mile. Oh, okay, just starting off. Is that? Uh, is, but if you have any experience, you will be probably be at forty five, forty six. Oh, okay, okay. Is that base? You know, is with no incentives. Yeah. That's that's coming yeah. in at forty cents. That's coming in at forty six cents for experience. 
Mm-hmm. Okay, okay. Now, somebody that got six months of experience, would they come in? Would would they come in as an experienced driver, or would they still have to go out with a uh, with a yeah, trainer? They have to come out with somebody. Yeah, they have to come out with the. Uh, they'll be out for a week mm-hmm. with the trainer, mm-hmm. and then you will start off with a uh, four or two sets. All right. What's uh? What, what's 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 what do you what do you think uh what do you think the best part of what's what is the best part of working at uh at uh at Hogan? Um Well that's, that's probably but every you know what I'm saying it's the the travel. Okay. You know, 'cause you're not you're not just going into Ohio, uh into um Ohio as long as we the lowest we go over there is like to Columbus, okay. but you got Pennsylvania, mm-hmm. Virginia, mm-hmm. New York, mm-hmm. Connecticut, and then you're coming right back down again. Okay, and you're going right back up to then some 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 of them you might go to Kentucky sometimes, but that's that's like very seldom. Okay, so what about let's. let's what what about um what about what what about the equipment? I know you said there's there was internationals, but what's what's yeah. what's what's uh what's the amenities in the truck? Do 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 they, what what do they have in the truck for the drivers? Oh, it's just a just a your basic uh truck. Oh, okay. You know, you bare bare bones. If you want to bare yeah, bones, yeah, yeah. Bare bones. No uh. Just do 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 it come with an inverter? Yeah. Oh, okay. What about what about an APU? Yeah. APU, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh what about what's what's the computer system that, that you that you had to use in the truck? It was the uh uh Qualcomm oh, L A D L E D or E L D, whatever it's called. Okay. What about uh what about a camera? Um, yeah, the company trucks, yes. Okay. The one I was just, when I was in, mm-hmm. uh, didn't have a, a, a camera. Okay. So it, was it a, but you say the company trucks, is it inside and outside or just outside? Outside. Oh, okay. Okay. So no, no inside cameras on, uh, on their yeah. trucks. But the truck, right. but the truck you was in didn't have a cam. Did it have a camera outside, or it didn't have a camera at all? It didn't. It, it didn't have a whatever. Well, so it didn't have a camera at all. No. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I got the newest truck. I had the um, you know, two thousand seventeen uh, Max. So I'm looking. I'm looking yeah. on the website. The, it's it got a uh, it got car haulers Hogan Hogan hauls cars yeah, here too yeah yeah yep yeah, yep yeah. they just started that um it was about maybe a year or so ago. okay well, I haven't seen them out there but now yeah they just I think they started about maybe a year or so ago. Okay. Maybe two years ago. Okay. Did what? 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 What did you? What? What did you haul? Did, was it drive in, reefer? Drive in. Drive in. What? Drive in. What was uh? Yeah. What was? What was the? What the uh? What was? What type of freight uh? Hogan uh uh hauls. Well, when I was there, I was with uh Dollar General, so everything that 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 uh a uh gen uh a uh. Dollar General store has. Mm-hmm. That's what I've uh, hauled. Okay, so that's touch freight. Yes. So Hogan Hogan had Hogan has an account with uh. Is it just Dollar General or all of the dollar accounts? It's all the uh. Well, no, it was just the uh dollar. It was just the uh, Dollar General account. Okay. Okay. So what's so being that it was touch freight. How much? How much did you? How much more did you get paid for for uh for touch freight for a Dollar General account? Uh, so that was um after you get to the store, it was uh, ninety dollars an hour 
So I know they paid back. No, twenty five an hour. So you got paid by the hour and not by the trailer? No, no, yeah, I got the trailer too. The trailer was um ninety, and then once I got to the store, uh, the uh, store it was twenty five an hour. Okay, so wait, 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 wait. Let me, let me see if I can understand it. So, you got you you got the miles. You you get the miles, mm-hmm. uh, mm-hmm. or travel time. The mm-hmm. for unloading the unloading the trailer is ninety dollars. It's one twenty five dollars an hour. No, okay, so it's twenty five dollars an hour, but you get ninety dollars yeah. for the trailer. Yes. All right, so ninety dollars for the trailer, and then mm-hmm. an additional twenty five dollars an hour for unloading right. the trailer. Right. So how many? So is so that's an hour for uh, you get twenty five dollars an hour for unloading each unloading stops, it. right? How right. What, what was your average mm-hmm. stops a day? Uh, three. So. What ten? Uh, well, let me see. Your your clock only gives you fourteen, and you only get to mm-hmm. and you only get eleven to drive. So, mm-hmm. what was the what was the average hours for unloading all three stops? Is that like eight hours all together? Um, no, it was. Uh, well, for me, I was I was doing I was doing three hours. Um, a store. So three sit. So nine, nine hours, pretty much. Mm-hmm. And you got mm-hmm. and you got twenty five dollars an hour for nine hours. Mm-hmm. Uh, that ain't bad. I mean, when you when you think about it that way, because I talked to I, I talked to uh I talked to my man Darnell. And he was telling me about the family dollar account because that's what he had. It was touch freight family dollar, but he didn't get paid an hour. He got paid $250 for $250 total for emptying out. I mean, for the trailer. So, Mm -hmm. so that's what I was, that's what I was saying. So, so for each, so the day you, you'll hook up, you you hook up to your trailer, that's nine that's ninety dollars for hooking up to the trailer. Boom. Yep. Then the mm-hmm. travel time, the the, the forty five like get the forty five cent to the to, to to the store. All right, so forty five cent a mile, uh, to the mm-hmm. you know to the store, and then mm-hmm. twenty five dollars an hour to un to unload. So yep. what was your what was your average a week man i mean what was your average week what was your average take home pay for my, for that? my take home pay approximately was about 14 is that is that after after or before after taxes, after taxes? After taxes. oh okay so after taxes is 14 mhm Okay, that's that's not bad but you 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 working for that 14 though i i take it yeah, yeah, you are. Yes, 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 you are. <laughs> you, 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 yeah, you are. You are sweating. You are losing a lot, of, a lot of cars. Uh, a lot. Of, yes, you are. Okay, so yeah, <laughs> you, you work. You working for that for that fourteen? Okay, okay. Right. Oh yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. All right. So that's uh. So yeah, that's you ain't going there sitting on your butt. Just you know, what I'm saying having the store guy do it. No, you doing that. <laughs> oh, okay. So this is uh. So this is so. Did did you want the Dollar General account, or that's all they had when you came in. Um, when I came in, that's all they had was the uh, Dollar. Yeah, so, yeah, so they had. So what was that? Now, one of the see they had the um the um over the uh, over the road mm-hmm. stuff. They didn't have it. Only they had to have some other accounts with um um Ashley's furniture. Um, and I think that was. That was the only two that they had there. Okay, okay. Do that. What was what was the drug test there? Was it urine or 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 hair follicle? No, it was just um, urine. Urine. How long's the orientation? Yeah. You know, the three days. Three days. Is it? Is the orient? Yeah. Is, so you must say two and a half. 
I was gonna say about two, two and a half. About two and a half days. Yeah. All right. What was the take? Take me through the orientation right quick. Of course, uh, a lot of videos, a lot of paperwork. When? Yeah. Uh, you did? Did you have to go out for a driver test? Yeah. Okay. How 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 was the how was the driver test? What what they was looking for? Yeah, the, the, what they was looking for? They was just if you can um handle the truck, mm-hmm. how you turn, mm-hmm. um and your uh bagging up. Oh, okay. They had you they 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 had you to back up in the dock or they had you to back up in the, you know, in the yard. So you got to go go into like a a um a, 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 in the yard, but you're if you're doing it like three times, so you, you got one spot that wears, you know, saying that is kind of kind of wide. First, you got one that's like you know in the medium uh uh spot, and then you got one that's like real close. Okay, so they got a uh... and see if you can um. Go go in there, but if you hit any one of them trailers, you're you're done. Oh, you're done. So they they, yeah. they don't get it's it's one and it's one and done, or do they give you like that? Yeah, that one and done oh, is one and one done. Because 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 you you're your experienced, so you 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 telling them that hey, I can back this truck up, I can drive this truck without no problems, I can do this. So they say, well, let me see. If you hit one. You're done. Oh, one, one and done. I see they got yeah, one and done. I, I see they got a. Uh, I see they got a uh, student drivers there, man. You, uh, you, you can can you uh, can you touch on uh, how the how the student drivers there work out? I mean, what what what's the oh. criteria? Yeah, I don't even know that because I never did. Okay. Yeah, I don't know about that because I was a, 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 a student driver, so okay, I went in there with uh. Six months, but well, how many? How how many? How how much is how much experience at at that time? At that time, because me and you both, we're we're in our fifth year of driving right now. So yeah, how how much? Is, how much? Three years. How, so you went into Hogan with three years of experience. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. So right, okay. So right off the bat, they they uh they they gave you uh sixty. I mean, not sixty. Uh, forty five cent to start because of your three years experience at the time. Yep. So what's what's the what's the bad? What's what's bad about the company, man? I mean, what's what you didn't like about the company? Uh, I was just going to to to, to one one state. You know, for for the whole time I was there, for like the whole for the whole eight months I was there, so I was just going to Pennsylvania, and I was asking, you know, saying, yo, I need to go somewhere else, mm-hmm. and but, but they kept me right there in Pennsylvania. <laughs> I fucking hate Pennsylvania, and that's you know, and and I did like <laughs> Pennsylvania <laughs> <laughs> at all. I went from the 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 east side to the to the state, the west side of the state, the north, the the, the south. I did I didn't like I seventy <laughs> nine. <laughs> and, and you know, for Pennsylvania, was, it, it seems like when you it it's like when you drive from Ohio to Pennsylvania, say like you know, it's like three hours to get to Pennsylvania from Ohio. Uh, or less than, mm-hmm. or less than that, if you're going down ninety and you're going into Pennsylvania, when you go down ninety, it's only like an hour right. and a half from where I'm at right here, like right here on Eddie Road. So from Eddie mm-hmm. Road to uh, Erie, PA, it's only an hour and a half, right? Right, right. But it's like a whole nother fucking twilight zone when you actually get into the fucking state. Yes. I mean, yes. I mean, to get from PA to, to get from PA to to like the end of PA to go up into Jersey, it takes for fucking ever. Yeah, yes, it does. I mean, yes. I Jesus, I mean, I, I <laughs> man, I hate PA. Mm-mm. Not a fan. Yeah, 
Not a fan. So you yeah. said so. Still, so so many hills, man. So yeah, yeah. Don't don't go don't go in there with a with a forty with, uh with forty four in the back, and and oh, I came in there with with, 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 with forty four uh in there all the time, <laughs> and uh oh, it's, uh. <laughs> so what else? It's murder on the body. Man. What what else? Uh, what what else about the company you didn't like, man? So you know that what um, what else? What else about the company that you didn't like? What what about yeah, what what know. about uh what what about the fleet managers? Uh, is there is there yeah, any? I had one. I was about to say that too. I had one uh fleet manager, dude. I uh, forgot where it came from. I think it was uh somewhere in uh. Missouri. Mm-hmm. It was this guy. You know, this, this this dude. He he will be. I mean, it's not even. I have like maybe forty five minutes in. You know, saying before my clock even starts for me to go ahead and go. This dude will be calling me up at three o'clock in the morning, wake me up out of my sleep. Hey, you ready to go? Are you ready to uh to uh you know? Are you ready to go? Are, are, you know, it was a couple of times I had to sit there and really and just like really just you know, cut cut this dude out because <laughs> I had to tell him like, "Hey man, I, I got like an hour left, man. What are you talking about? You know, it's like it's like that. You know, that you're over here first, then you went over there. You know, where are you? I was like, dude, what? he's I'm in the same. I mean, he just kept doing that. He's trying to micromanage you. Know, you. That's that's yeah. yeah, that's that's. And I was like, look. I, I told him, say like, yeah, I said, man, look, if I ever come to, you know, to your state, I'm going to find you. <laughs> <laughs> you say you're going to find this bro and try to shut this dude down, yeah, huh? You know, a couple of times I didn't answer. Just boom, the phone up. I mean, this wow. dude was just, I mean, I was like, yeah, I was like, man, look, I'm about to ready to leave. You know what I'm saying? Because on how he was acting. And I knew he was one of the, you know, uh, Micromanage and everything right there, and I told him that too. So, he didn't say anything about that. Then he started calling. Uh, once I wasn't uh, answering the phone calls, he would call my primary, his uh, uh, fleet manager, mm-hmm. and, and he would be, you know, and, and, and she would be uh, calling me, hey, I think his name was Michael or something. Hey, Mike is calling you. What's going on? You know, you know and I had to tell her. You know, the same same thing that I tell tell him. Okay, okay, that's what's up, man. So, so yeah, this so that's right so there. that's so right there. You 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 came across some came across some micromanaging uh, uh, fleet manager. So of course you didn't like that going up into PA. Yeah. Uh, you didn't yeah. like that. They that they they had you stuck uh, going up into PA a lot. Uh, is there is there anything else that comes to mind that you yeah. that uh that you didn't yeah. like about the company? Yeah. Um well actually it was um going into the stores because you are going and you are going to the stores and you are um one on one with the managers there. Mm-hmm. Some managers were cool, some would just, you know, cuss you out for for no reason, mm-hmm. and and then the fed, you know, um, and they that they they was basically they were assholes. Some is some of them. I only came across maybe three of them mm-hmm. that actually did that. And uh, but but uh, all in all, most of the, the uh. The store managers there, they were they were cool. Okay, okay. So, um, so would you would were you able to take the truck home when you when you got finished? Yeah. For your uh, yeah. for your for your days off. Now, be, now, yes, now sir. this is now now this is um uh, PA. You you will. Where's the distribution center to pick up at to go to? To go to PA, was it in Ohio? Zanesville. Yeah, Zanesville. Ohio. Oh, it was in Zanesville, Ohio. Okay, so from yeah. so from Zanesville, Ohio, you'll go, uh, you'll go to PA, 
finish mm-hmm. up PA. Was you able to get back the same day or the same? Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. If you wanted to, if you wanted to come back the same day, yeah, you can. Oh, okay. But if you don't want to, then you know, you should go to your local uh, truck stop, mm-hmm. you know, sit there, get a shower, you know, and, uh, you know, be back in the morning. Okay. Get another Try trailer. And then head back, back out. out again. Okay. But you said yeah. you, you were able to take the truck, the, the truck home though, right? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Um did you did you get a full uh did you get a full two days off or did you get a or was it a thirty four reset? A so thirty four reset. But you have some of the some some of the days um that you can uh come home. So you, you work Monday, Tuesday, you probably be home Wednesday, you come out Friday, Saturday. Uh, 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 Thursday, Friday, mm-hmm. you got the two days, or you you can work that that uh, Saturday, be home that Sunday, Monday. Right. So you always, you know, if you wanted to do all do all that, but if you want to, you know, come come home uh, that 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 Friday, mm-hmm. Saturday, uh, four twenty four, and you got. The uh, Sunday to what? Probably three, four o'clock in the morning. Oh, okay. You can go there, pick up a uh, trailer. Okay. Go back to your, you know, go go back to the, uh, you know, go to the store, mm-hmm. unload, and do your three. Mm-hmm. You know, get get your ten hour in. Go right back out again. Okay. Get another one. Go right back out again. So. Okay. Uh, do do they hire fi- uh fi- Do they hire felons? Felon? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. So Ken, man, the last question I want to ask you about this company, man, is uh, uh, if they didn't have if if they do they help you get your CDLs? Do they do they have a CDL sponsor school or anything like that? No. Oh, okay. What about uh? What about what about other opportunities there, like uh, like uh, lease leasing or uh, lease options, yeah, and stuff like that. Yeah, matter of fact, the um the last truck I was in, I was um going to the uh lease purchase uh program. Oh, okay. So you okay? So, so talk talk. So you was about to, you say you was about to be a lease purchase program. What happened with that? Talk about that a little yeah. bit. Um. Well, it, it was some some some, some personal uh, uh, things. Okay. You know, my uh, you know, I really don't really, really want to talk about that All right there. Well, yeah, but yeah, we, that's yeah. the reason why I didn't, you know, really been going there. But I did it for like, um, I did it for like three months. Oh, okay. So you did three months. So how? So yeah. how? How was uh? How was it leasing? Uh, leasing through there you you had to oh the leasing part pro program was oh man yeah that's 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 better than any uh company they that, that that's uh out here um theirs was um anything that's on the truck so how much you had to pay, pay so uh, how much you had to pay a week you, you paying how, nothing nothing you uh well uh, that uh no you'd be paying like two Two fifty. What two fifty? Two fifty a week for the truck. Yeah. Wait, is this lease option to own or just leasing? Yes. Yeah. yeah. No leasing option to own. Two hundred and fifty dollars for the truck a week. Yeah. Wait. What and year? What year was the truck that you got? I mean, that they got. That was a uh, seventeen. Two hundred and fifty. That was an Wait. Eighteen. Two hundred and fifty dollars a week for twenty seventeen. Yeah. Yeah. But okay, so that was just for the truck. What what other what other right. payments that you that 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 you had to kick out for? I mean, through leasing. Nothing. It was it, it was it, it was all that right there. It covered everything. So are your PMs, um, anything was going on entire um uh, in the truck um uh, electrical, um. Anything from the uh, the truck top to bottom, everything in there. All right, so was 
You know what I'm saying? You ain't got to worry about none of that. All right, so. The fueling, you ain't got to worry about that. Only thing you had to really uh, kick out was if you blew a tire, the tire is like what? About a good two, three hundred dollars yeah. for one. <laughs> okay, okay. All right, you, you paying high for that. Oh, okay. Let me. Okay, so okay, so so leasing two hundred and fifty dollars a week. How how much was uh, what what was the CPM for a lease driver was or is it percentage or CPM? That was a was uh, CPM. I think that went up to a dollar ten. A dollar ten a mile. Yeah. Some 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 veteran drivers was would would say that's that's kind of nasty right there. That's, <laughs> this, this, a lot a lot of veteran drivers would say that is that is nasty. So that's that's all Hogan. That's is it a dollar ten for you know based based on based on your experience or is it more if you have more experience or it's just no, or it's it just was, a dollar no, ten right going, off the rip yeah yeah if you go in there say i want to um uh, i'm i want to be in the lease lease of uh, the uh, lease lease purchase to um uh option to buy to dollar ten a dollar, like I said, a, a lot of a lot of veteran drivers would say that's 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 kind of nasty. That's kind of, ugh. That's kind of, ugh. Um, <laughs> all right. Um, all right. Well, Hogan. Hmm. All right, Hogan Transportation, y'all. If y'all interested in uh in going with Hogan Transportation, you could definitely call a recruiter eight six six three ten seven seven eight two. Uh. They have look like they got uh, not just in Ohio, but it looks like they got terminals. Uh, look like they got terminals all over, man. Look like they got uh, they got one, a couple of them in the Northeast, uh, a couple of them in the Midwest, uh, uh, one down in Texas, and the other ones all the way up in uh, Seattle, Washington. So if you guys. Uh, live in live in these areas, Wisconsin, Missouri, uh, Denver, Texas, Ohio. You know, you guys can definitely uh give them a call. Hey, Ken, man, thank you for coming on and um uh, and uh telling us what the good and the bad. What what is before you leave, man? What is the downright ugly of the company, man? The downright ugly, like ugly <laughs> is there is there any is there any ugly you know, I, I really I, I really don't even have anything to, you know what I'm saying to be like like really like grainy with all that cause you know ever since since, since that one guy Mike that was the, that's like a, 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 the basically, basically the only thing man oh okay the, the, the company is good you know oh. I can't even say. Okay, okay. So he can't. He, yeah. he can't say nothing. He can't say nothing bad about. He can't say nothing bad about the company. So that's 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 a good thing, man. That's a good thing. So um. So, well, I did say something bad about. Well, no, we got like ugly. I said, we got the bad. I mean, you know, that's what it's all about, man. That's what it's all about. The good and the bad of the of the company. You know, and it's always you know. A lot of people want want to know from a driver's perspective. Now we can get what the what the recruiter would say. I mean, the cr- recruiter would say anything just to get you in the seat. A driver will pretty much, you know, tell them unless unless a driver is biased. You know what I'm saying? There there are some right. biased drivers that would say Hogan is the best thing since sliced bread and they don't have nothing bad to say about the company but you know but it is what it is though man all right so i appreciate you coming on man chopping it up with me we're gonna have to come back again and do an actual interview man we gotta we gotta talk about where we came from and shit man so if you got if you guys if you guys want to know more about Hogan, like I said, go ahead and um, find them on on uh, on Indeed. You can find the reviews on Indeed and everything like that. Uh, other than that, 
Uh, Ken, man, I appreciate you coming on, telling us about Hogan no problem. again. No problem. And uh, on that note, everybody, until next time, until next time, we'll find somebody that has another company that wants to, uh, that they want to not throw up under the bus or just talk about it. I'll let you know. And on that note, we are gone.